Okay, one last note. <laughs> Although it sucks sometimes, not, not all the time, but sometimes it sucks having to keep pressing on alone and, um, you know, like just the amount that you know. Anyway, I'm like way too tired for this right now, but walking in your truth and like realizing the the true intentions of people around you it's like that stuff is like it's truly priceless it's truly mind-blowing because and it's not even that I think I don't even know who you'll never know if some of these people actually liked you or cared about you at some point in time I mean I'm sure family does you know but like other people that you've come in contact with that decide to be your ops now and maybe they're just, maybe they just like the game. That's what I mean. Like, I mean, there's got to be some, there's got to be jealousy, but like, they might just think that it's fun. Like, it's funny. And, um, but you're living it. <laughs> you're living the other side of it where it's like, you're having to deal with this flack. So, um, but that stuff is priceless because, and it's such valuable information because it's like, especially if you, even if even if you're not someone chasing your dreams, but you're like some kind of like entrepreneur or you just have that like, I'm doing my, I'm, I'm building my own life type of thing. It's like, you have to have the people that are going to support you. Like, um, and that stuff that's like, if you can't even, you don't even know that until you're riding with God. And it's like, I mean, when you're like fully, <laughs> doing that because then you're like wow these no one none of these people actually and because I it's not that I I've always I've probably always been like a little bit picky and choose like I've always been a little bit stingy with my time and energy I've always been a little bit that way because I don't know I just have always been like okay being on my own but like I know I've also been like selfless in situations too and like been there for other people and I know that I've cared and stuff so it's like that's what I mean that's crazy is it's like you know there's so many people that you may have given so much of yourself and they just didn't care they were just going to keep taking and um yet God opens your eyes to that like because I will I will still want to believe, want to like believe in the good in people be in the good in the world because it's like we do need each other like we do need to believe in that because we need connection um even if it's just moments of it so um because it does get I know that it's just my this journey and I'm sure everybody goes through these places where you're in isolation it feels very apocalyptic like that's like that water I mean that water world movie is like extreme obviously but like things are literally just falling apart and like you don't have any you know you're like you're like all right well I guess that's that's where we are because it's like and there's people just like wanting to throw arrows at you and you're like all right well I feel it's like hunger games because it's like I did not mean to be talking about this so long, but it's like, you're like, well, I guess I got me. Like, <laughs> I guess I got a shield of armor with God because that's, that's all I've got. I don't have, I don't have any, uh, you know, weapons for your emotions is like a different kind of thing. So, um, you know, you got to put your armor up. <laughs> you got to laugh because it's fucking insane. All right. I love you guys. Take care of yourselves and rest when you need to. Okay.